All right, the third goal, uh, we got to get a lead of at least 328 yard or 300 meters by the end of your fourth lap. So basically win by uh, 300 meters, right? Yeah. All right, car is slightly in critical condition. We're starting in, what position am I starting in, like fifth? Yeah, all right. Got four laps to create some separation, so... Can we get up to the lead early on? All right, third place. After the first corner. Oh. And they ask for 300 meters. See how easy or difficult that's gonna be. Uh, running no upgrade with the car in critical condition, skidding a bit more. So the grip has definitely taken a bit of beating. have to be a little bit more conservative heading into these corners but lap two we got can we keep that lead above a hundred meters please come on all right getting closer to 200 meters and plus break a little bit earlier Keep it together, come on. All right, in lap two, we're able to get some 200 meters plus. So almost 300. Stay on track. And now we're, looks like beginning to lap some slower part of the grid without getting slowed down which is important because uh, if the second place gets stuck behind this traffic then obviously that does make the challenge a bit easier for us so whoa unforced error all right so not quite 400 at the end of third lap, but uh, definitely now. Whoa! Yes, as I was saying about traffic. Need to go around them. All right. They ask for 300 meters plus lead. 500 and 600 and counting all right of course we do lose a bit of lead and there we go pretty decent margin And a bit more uh, messier race out there. But that's a okay. Winning by some, what, 11 second? 11 second gap, yep. So apparently that equals to be about the lead gap of. 300 plus meters i think i was in 400s but who's counting right all right so three goals down one final goal to go to wrap up stage one so stay tuned for the conclusion of stage one in the next video all right see you then